Hey, this is Shalini Joshi Amdagni and in this video I wanted to talk about the one thing that you can do that can help you speed up your healing journey. So what is that one thing? Interestingly, it is stop criticizing yourself. Maybe you're healing, uh, something recently happened and because of that, you're now uh, trying to heal this physical pain or relationship pain or whatever the case may be for you. And you may be beating yourself up and saying, you know, gosh, like, why wasn't I uh, more careful? Why didn't I think this through? Why did I take risks? And now I'm here in this, uh, in this painful situation, you know, and just uh, beating yourself up for that. Or maybe you are already well into your healing journey and you're beating yourself up because you think, gosh, I've been on this journey for a while now and by now I should have had that much progress and look at others who are at the same time and they're far ahead or uh, just feeling, uh, you know, disappointed in yourself that you haven't made the progress that you wanted to make, maybe not done as much as you think you should have done and criticizing yourself and, you know, punishing yourself for not being where you think you're supposed to be and also maybe you are you know you've you've been on a on a long uh, healing journey you've done this many times and you know you find yourself getting triggered again about the same issue and you think what the heck i've been on this healing journey for so long and uh, here it is again, what's wrong with me? Am I damaged? Am I broken? Am I, is something wrong with me? How come I, I keep bumping into this over and over again? And um, we've all been through this. We've all been through this in different areas of, your, uh, of our lives, right? And sometimes, you know, in the healing, the healing journey is never a straight road, right? Life is not a straight road and so you, find that many times when you are when you are uh, you know going one step forward you might be going one step backward or two steps backwards and then things start to you know to to go on a uh, on a decent momentum and then you have a big drop back and and everything comes to a halt and then you start again and so the important thing is that you know criticizing and getting angry with yourself and hating on yourself and beating in uh, beating yourself up doesn't speed up the healing it doesn't speed up the things that you want to change in your life it doesn't speed up the shifts you want to create in your life it slows everything down because when you are beating yourself up when you're hating on yourself when you're disappointed and, and angry with yourself then you're res you're in resistance there's so much this internal tug of war that your energy which could be used you know in the healing of the body right the body is a self-healing tool and it knows how to heal itself and instead of all the energy going into healing it's you know it's fighting itself it's you're using it to uh beat yourself up and so what if we could all try a different way of uh, you know going about this whenever we find ourselves in this place of starting to beat ourselves up and you can say to yourself i've done that enough i'm going to try something different what if i could love myself what if i could forgive myself uh, and allow the healing? What if I could appreciate how far I've come and all that I do and all that I keep, you know, doing for myself, for my others, uh, for the other people in my life? And what if you could begin to celebrate 
all that you are, all that you do. And yes, it's not perfect right now. And everything is temporary and this will pass too. But loving yourself and appreciating yourself will get you much further ahead of where you are right now than criticizing yourself. I hope that makes sense. I hope that was helpful. And um, I, if you, if you like what I shared, I have a whole book that's coming out on instant pain relief, and it shares with you a simple and effective approach to healing chronic pain. But it's so much more. If you can learn how to manage your stress, to manage your pain, to uh, you know make peace with your past, to forgive yourself and a lot more stuff. So if you are curious and interested in equipping yourself with a life tool that can help you navigate all kinds of changes that life throws at us, then please sign up for being alerted when the book is out. It's March 9th. And uh, once you're alerted, you know, you will, you will, you will get informed automatically. So Thank you for joining me. I hope this was helpful and I'll see you in my next video. Bye guys.